I've heard a story about some brothers who are hustling harder than the tape rooms. <laughs> you know what? Well, true story. Yeah. True story. Yeah. So how did it go? He started when I was 12. He was 11. Third brother is not here right now, but he was 10. So it actually started through uh, cereal boxes, reselling cereal boxes in school. I used to buy them from random supermarkets, take them to school, sell them to my friends, double it for a profit. I started there and then I eventually moved on to sneakers. Bought my, my first pair of sneakers. I waited in line actually six, seven hours for it. Wow. Then I took it out and I wrote, resell, uh, resold it online yeah. through Instagram, and website, just through family and friends originally. So we started getting our name out there. And then my dad wasn't a fan actually. My mum was the only person on our side. She was taking us in the early mornings, dropping us off to the malls, yeah. buying the pairs, waiting in line. And my dad wasn't a fan at all. And then my dad eventually got on board once he's seen how big the industry is here and how big the market is. My dad got on board and we go, we just open a store. And here we are. In the here store. we are now, yeah. Yes, yeah, so it's not easy. But here we go, we got all the sneakers here. You even got me some sneakers. <laughs> yeah. Talk G's hooked up. <laughs> and we had, a, we had to put a cafe yeah. here. Dad's a fan of coffee, so yeah. The other easiest with the red brain was the one we actually waited six hours for. Yeah, Tristan's there. Wow. That was our Tristan's first bit. Tristan's first. Yeah. Well, I'm happy and I can uh, run from the agents of the Matrix a little bit if I need to. <laughs> and, yeah. Uh, yeah, Tristan's was really nice as well. So, yeah, yeah. an amazing story here. Yeah. Thank you very much. Proud of you guys. Thank you. Genuinely Thank proud of you. And good coffee too. So, Is it? You know, it's all wrong one. I said, I'm part parents, part, you know? Yeah? Yeah. They're doing a good job. Yeah, thank you very much. But surely this is what you learn in school though, right, Baz? Not at all. <laughs> no, no, not at all. <laughs> whoa, whoa, you're telling me they don't teach you how to make money in school? No, they don't. Nah. What do they teach you in school nowadays? They teach you how to be an employee. They, they, I don't know if school's changed a lot since my day. I feel old sitting here next to you guys, but yeah, they Sorry. teach. How you doing, bro? You good? That's the third brother. Ah, third brother. Yusuf, yeah. They, they teach you a whole bunch of things that aren't necessarily conducive to your Nine overall years. success. Not at all, actually. And uh, a lot of the lessons in life you have to learn the hard way or you have to learn through experience. It's amazing wow. you guys have started so young and that's exactly what you're doing. Yeah. Um, obviously, I teach a lot of people a lot of things online and try and cut a lot of the garbage and get through to it, but yeah. ultimately, no matter how much people listen to my words, unless they take some action and put themselves in the thick of it and uh, become forged in fire, you're never going to learn. So you guys are learning everything you need to know about life, about business, about managing people, managing relationships, expectations, saving your money.